Hello everyone, my name is Clayton Brockape. I'm the program director for Traditional Native American Farmers Association. We're based in just north of Santa Fe, New Mexico. And I'm happy to hear that there's a global bean project. We have a, uh, a family farm and we grow many different varieties of beans. And why we grow beans is that um, it provides a great protein and that's one of the things that our, our bodies need, our good protein every day. It has um, very little fats, but it does have some fats in it. The other part of what um, we enjoy growing beans for is that um, the ones that we have are climate adapted to our area. We have a very short season and very little water. So we are growing, this year actually we're only growing, I think, four different varieties of beans. Last year we grew six different varieties, and in previous years we've grown up to 12 different varieties of beans. They're different colors, different shapes, but um, what the other reason we like to grow beans is each one has a different flavor, and they can be cooked at different in different um, dishes. And one of my favorite meals is actually um, a, a real simple bean, it's called a pinto bean, northern New Mexico, and, but we add um, what we call a chico. It's a, a corn that's at its milky stage. We roast it and we dry it, and then we put it in with the beans, and then we use a, um, a, an herb, a wild-grown herb called zimaha. We put that in there, and sometimes a fresh roasted green chili. That's my favorite meal. Um, any, any day, that's what I like to eat. So, and plus, the beauty of um, beans is that they help other plants because they'll fix nitrogen in the soil. Like I said, we grow a pinto bean. It's, it's brown and um, it's got little spots on it. Um, it's very prolific, very tasty. We have another bean, it's yellow, uh, very bright yellow and it's freshly um, harvested. Uh, the other one that we grow um, is a black bean. The black beans aren't that productive where we are, but one of my grandchildren loves black beans, so we're growing it. There's another one that we grow. Um, it's larger. It's a runner bean. So those runner beans will cross with other beans, so we don't grow it as often. And it's purple, a light purple and a dark purple. And they're a lot bigger the insects and the hummingbirds love it because it has a red blossom to it. Um, I'm trying to think of some of the other beans that we've grown over the years. Um, we grow peas in the spring because they like the cool. It's also a legume. What we've been doing with those beans is actually intercropping with our corn. Um, another because the the corn takes a lot of nitrogen and the bean provides nitrogen. The other one we tried isn't indigenous to our area is a garbanzo, which is also a legume. And we've we've intercropped those with our corn also. And they 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 really enjoy each other's company I'll say. And again, garbanzos are you know high in protein, but the garbanzos that we've been growing are either brown or black. We've found those two varieties and they're delicious, and again, my children, I like to eat them and my children love to eat them.